Uh, yeah, uh Bitch, I've been the man, the man since 89 Came about my mama with goals, I had to grind That was mind over matter, pay niggas, no, never mind Back on my bullshit, Michael Jordan in 45 I got what you need, you need, just get in line One time got caught slipping, got caught up by one time Had my face all in the paper, but tears in my mama eyes We was on the block, boy, no JB, we looked alive Shoot the dice on the F, I lost it, then made it back Bet it up, double that, head crack, head crack Get the cash, get the ass, Steve Nash with the pass Got the drive, no crash, only do beef What's good everybody, it's your boy Uncle Sam's Reject here And welcome back to our Seton Hall Dynasty over here on MVP 07 40 and 18 on the year, we have advanced to the uh, Super Regional you know what I'm saying? We we got we uh, fought, fought and clawed our way out of the losers bracket to get to this point. We're gonna be taking on the uh, Tennessee Vols here in Knoxville. And if you also see for a, a beautiful surprise, I don't know if I covered this last episode. We are now ranked in the top 25 in the nation. We are sitting at number 21. What a turnaround that we've had from last year, and we're really not even as good as I feel like we will be in the future. Now, quickly coming over here to stats before we jump into this game and everything like that. Ozzy Zuniga, you know, at this point is our best hitter, 338 average. Kyle Foster, who's had some big time, you know, RBIs and hits and home runs, 337 with 17 bombs, 48 ribbies. Ozzy Johnson, 311. Rick Wright, 309 with 11 bombs. Alex, Alex Hunter, you know, he he's had, you know, he's not the highest, so he's at 297. So our next starter at the highest is Ellie Cummins, 294. Fatma, 277. Roy, 256. Pimentel, 256. You know, we could hit better. You know, especially for some of those guys who are in the middle of our lineup. Pitching-wise, Colin Daniel and D'Angelo Brandon are still leading the way with the top ERAs on the squad. D'Angelo Brandon only has 20 innings pitched, though. So, you know, it's not as impressive. But for Colin Daniel, 77 innings pitched, 29 appearances. He also started a game 7-0 out of the year, majority, majority out of the bullpen. Two saves, one blown save. You know, you see the one start here. He got the W. No shutouts. You know, only seven runs against. Uh, the dude is a beast right now. As far as starters, Whit Chapel is above 500 now at 8 and 7, but the true freshman Dawson Halley. Oh, I backed out of that by mistake. Going back here. The true freshman Dawson Halley is at 92 on the year. ERA is sky high, in my opinion, but you know, 92 in those 11, you know, in those 11 decisions, you know, for a true freshman is absolutely beast. A lot to here to come. If he keeps this up, he should probably definitely get drafted. 50 strikeouts and 21 walks. Now what we've all been waiting for here, Knoxville Super Regional, here on a Friday, 6 p.m. is your game time. You already know we are the away team here. We're supposed to have Kutzer on the mound, but we're going to go ahead and skip down and get our boy Holly on the mound. He's our best pitcher out here to this date. They have Bio, um, their dude Jay Bio on the mound. He's an 83 overall. Their pitching rotation is pretty, is pretty disgusting. But you know what I'm saying? We come out here and make plays. Um, going over our starting lineup here, you see Pimentel. Those three days off did him some, did him some good. So he's at 72%. You know, but uh, we're going to go ahead and switch the, the batting order up a little bit. And when I'm done, I'm going to let you guys uh, check it out. All right, guys. So here's, here's the starting lineup for today. Ozzy Johnson leading this off. Ozzy Zaniga batting in the two spot. Rick Wright still three. Kyle Foster still clean up. Pimentel is in the fifth spot. Zelly Cummins moves down to six. Roy at 7, Kleppinger at 8, and Fatma at 9. Oh, so it looks like I was wrong. They're also going with a different starter besides the dude they had scheduled as well. They're going with C. Bond. He's 75 on the year, 215 ERA. They're 37 and 16 on the season, so we definitely have the better record. And moving on, looking like looking to see how we stack up on paper. Completely outmatched. They're A-plus overall. We're C-minus. We got C-minus, C, C-minus, B. They're A, A, B, B-minus, C-minus. Our work is going to be cut out for us, but I believe we can come out here and at least make it competitive. If we don't move on to Omaha, you know, it's still a great season, but we're definitely not going to, you know, just uh, tuck our tails and run. We're going to come out here and fight. So you see here, Tennessee is ranked number four nationally. So, you know, uh, they're about that life. You know what I'm saying? So best out of three series, as most of you guys know already. You know, if we can still game one, I feel like that would be a plus. Beautiful day out here, man. Lindsey Nelson Stadium. You guys know how we've been doing here in the postseason for the most part, giving you guys the full games. You know what I mean? Because the games move rather quickly, and that's how we're going. You know, we're going to keep that. Uh, we're going to keep that here. But Cliff Bond on the mound, 75 as we discussed. You see his ERA, 113 in his pitch, 80 hits, 41 walks, 114 strikeouts. All right, Isaac Johnson leading us off here. You already know. Let's get it. 
Ah, we swing at the first pitch, as you guys know. For those of you guys who don't know, I swing at a lot of the first pitches because I play on strikes only to keep the games moving and get them fast. So that's why I'm not patient at the plate as some of you guys feel like I should be. All right, Ozzy. Switch hitter. New spot here in the two hole. Let's get it done. Okay, didn't like that pitch. You can have it. Ozzy the niggas had some big ABs here in the postseason. Let's see if he can keep it up. Ah, pulled off of an of a off-speed pitch. We had no business. Should have hit it where it's pitched. Just get beat by the first baseman there. You see our starting lineup here again. Rick Wright coming up the bat. Got to get it done. All right, Rick. Come on, baby. Get it started here. A little two-hour rally, kid. Oh, found that one off his shin. All right, Rick. Let's go. Let's get a hold of one here, kid. Let's hit one in the gap. Woo. All right, tough for two here. Let's just put it in play. There it is. Get out, ball. Get out, ball. Get out, ball. Go. That's an absolute bomb, baby. Get off me, ball. That's what I love to see, dog. Let's get it, man. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. That's the way to get on the board here early, man. Rick Wright with a big fly. No doubt shot the left field. You see the bench is hype. You know what I'm saying? I'm hyped. Let's go, man. That's just how we start the game. You know, one for one, 419 feet. You can't hit it any harder than that, man. Stop on the feet. Stop on the plate. Let them know we're here, dog. All right, so clean up, man. Kyle Foster coming up the bat here. See if he can pick up where Rick left off. Ah, 92 mile per hour sinker. Tried to pull off of that one. Got a little bit too excited. Got to see where it's pitch. Hit it where it's pitch, you know. There it is. Get down, ball. Get down, ball. Get down, ball. Hey, he tagged that one, but it's just right out the right fielder. But, hey, we get on the board here in the first inning. Let's see if our pitchers can come out here and shut them down. Our pitchers. Our pitcher. So, guys, I forgot I made a shirt for this exact moment and for this exact series. You know what I mean? Get off me ball shirts. Going up in the store soon. You know what I mean? But it's one of my sayings. And I forgot, you know, I got shirts for every series. But, you know, sometimes I just forget to throw them on. But, you know what I mean? We back and we live. <clears throat> we already know who's on the mound for us here today. Dawson Howley, 9-2, 422 ERA, 74 and two-thirds innings pitch, 90 hits given up, 50 strikeouts and 21 walks. All right, so they're, they're leadoff guy and their three-hole hitter. Both got some power. It's got some pop to them. All right, let's go, Dawson. Do what you do. Dawson Howley is, like, our hardest throwing pitcher. This probably, uh, you know, except for some people in the bullpen. But he just starts to throw harder and harder as the game goes along. His slider is his money pitch as we throw it there, but he gets hit right back up the box. And they got themselves a runner here early. Okay. All right, we go. Let's try to throw a ground ball here. Oh, they're trying to bunt. They're trying to bunt him over early. They're, they want to play small ball early. They want to get their guys in scoring position. They want to manufacture runs. Station to station. I don't blame him. He squares around again. That one's popped up. Get their pin and tail. And we got the first out. All right, let's go. This is the guy we should be afraid of. 89, 88 contact, 89 power, 85 speed. This is a five-tool player. Lowered away with the, with the uh, slaughter. Get up, got him way out in front. All right, let's jam him with the two-seamer inside. That's our fast pitch we throw. You see way, way behind on that one. That one was damn near in the catcher's glove before he swung. That's what I love to see, baby. Money pitch right here. Slaughter away. See you. Okay. That's deep in the hole. I feel like that was our best play. I feel like that was our best play. That dude's got wheels down the line. So, ball deep into the six hole. Wasn't a hard hit, but it's perfectly placed. Now we got ourselves some trouble here. Get us another ground ball. There we go. Dawson Halley, man, you know, once he came back, he was suspended for, you know, the beginning of the postseason. Once he came back, I believe he has two wins, you know, up here on the mound since he's come back. That's a ground ball. Taylor May, turn it. Get him out of here, baby. That's what I love to see. Beautiful, man. Way to get yourself out of that jam. Fatma coming across the bag, making a play. Roy and Fatma is probably the best tandem up the middle in the nation. Five, six, seven, leading us off here. Jacob Pimentel, to be exact, is going to be our leadoff man here. You know, to start off this end. And let's see if he can get a hole in one. He's had some clutch hits here. Ah, we got to hit it where it's pitched. Can't get excited. Got to stop trying to pull off. Come on, kill One count. Still in a good hitter's count here. Get yours. Ah, I told we tried to hit it where it was pitched, but we were still out in front of it. Must change ups are filthy in this game. I'm lucky. I'm lucky I even stayed back on it. Another change up. That one was inside. 
We beat him to the ground. It's going to be a tough play for the pitcher. And Pimentel, the catcher, has an infield single, baby. Let's go. All right, so we got ourselves a base runner here early. Let's go. Come on, Zelly. Ah, that ain't it, kid. That ain't it. All right, we let that one get in our kitchen a little bit. Change up. It was inside. We try to hit it the other way. That's going to be a tailor-made double play. We move. Oh, Zelly Cummins actually beats that out because the throw the throw was off was offline. Took him off the bat. All right, so just a fielder's choice. Come on, Roy. We need you. Ah, wait back on that. Fouls that one off his shin. I'm going to do a little hit and run here. Come on, Roy. Ah, you got to put it fair. You got to put it fair, man. Come on. All right. 0 2 count. Fight. Ooh, that sinker was dirty. That sinker was dirty. All right. Anthony Clevenger up. 81 contact, 44 power. More of a contact dude against righties, but he rakes against lefties. Fastball coming inside. That one gets in on our hands a little bit. Lazy ground ball to second baseman, and that's going to do it here in this inning. All right. So we don't add to our lead at all here. But, you know, because, you know, a lead, uh, even a little lead is better than, you know what I'm saying, a small lead. Excuse me, Dawson Halley. He's always the dude we want on the mound. Even though I thought Whit Chapel was going to be that guy. Lazy fly ball to right field. Zaniga's there, and that's easy can of corn. Let's go. <clears throat> we still got to be careful here, but this part of the lineup isn't as dangerous as, you know, the, the top third or top, probably not even the full third, probably just probably like the top quarter. But we don't want to leave one over the middle and have them take it out of here as that's a lazy pitch. That one is gone. As soon as I said that, the hitter gets a hold of one. It was a wall scraper, but they tie it up with a solo shot of their own. Wow. All right. All right, so the Tennessee bench is lit there. They're happy. You know what I'm saying? They got on the board. This guy's only batting 292 on the year, too, but it, it is what it is. All right. Get your bearings back here. You know what I mean? Continue to make pitches. There you go. Get aggressive right after you give up the home run. A lot of room over there. Rick Wright makes the play. Ooh, all right, so we, we already knew, you know, against the number one. Oh, Rick Wright making another play. We already knew coming in against the number four uh, ranked team in the nation that one run wouldn't be enough. So we were already ready for that. So it just happened a little bit early. Jacob Roy coming up the bat here. You see the numbers. I mean, Jacob Fontman, excuse me. You see the numbers. Nothing too crazy, but he was still one of our better hitters, This you know, in early on in the season as he lazy hits a lazy fly ball to third base. You know what I'm saying? Uh, his lineup turns over. Even though it is strikes only, sometimes I feel like I can be a more be a, a bit more patient. But you know, we'll get there as the game goes on. Like we normally do. They try to get in on Isaac's kitchen and what a play from the shortstop. That ball just hung up there a little bit more than I thought it would. I thought he hit it a little bit harder. But here we go. Ozzy Zaniga 0 for 1 on the day. 337 on the year. We need you. There it is. Get over his head, and we got ourselves a two-out single. Rick Wright coming up the bat with a runner on. We know what he did last A B. One for one on the day with a home run. It was a oh, it was a two a two strike home run at that. You know what I'm saying? Let's be aggressive here. There it is. Get down the line. What a play from the third baseman, Wills Rick. Oh my goodness! Dun -dun 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 -dun. What a web gem down the third base line. I thought for sure that was going to be two, but what a play from over there by the third baseman. Props to him. All right, so the game continues to move on here. We just got to make our pitches. That one's up the middle. Fatma doing what he does in the field. What a play. Fielding, you know, Fatma may not do it all, you know, with the bat, but in the field, he is one of the better, one of the best second basemen any, any, anybody could ever ask for, man. Like 100% as Howley gets a, gets a first strike over there. Another slider low and away. This dude really, you really don't want to come in this dude's kitchen. You see his hot zones there. So we're going to try to stay away. Righty lefty matchup. Like, I do so every now and then want to surprise somebody inside, but this dude's just ready for that. Clevenger makes a stop, but it doesn't matter as it's a foul ball. Now we're going with the hard stuff away. It's a two-seamer, and he's, he smashes that one back up the box. All right, lineup turns over. That was a nine-hole hitter. As he gets on there, we go up top with the fastball. Good pitch. Bottom three. If we can get ourselves another ground ball, one of those, one of those, uh, turn one of those double plays, 
you know that we that we love to get so so often from our pitchers. I'll be good. And there it is. Perfect. Turn to Fatma quick. That a baby. Way to get out of that, man. Let's go. Let's get these sticks going, fellas. All right, so we got four, five, six coming up here at the top of the fourth inning. Let's go. All right, come on, Kyle Foster. You gotta gotta take advantage of these righty lefty matchups. Fastball comes in. We were just late on it. Just late on it. Ooh, the changeup. He pulled the pulled the string a little bit there, and we were out in front of it. Lazy fly ball to the first baseman. <clears throat> All right, Pimentel, you got a base knock here today. See if you can keep it up, kid. Hit that where it's pitched, baby. That a boy right back up the box. That's what I love to see. All right, Zelly, we got ourselves a base runner here, man. You were one of our better hitters last year. We need some of that magic here today. Ah, just gets under that one. Can the corn for the left fielder. All right, John Roy struck out here today. Definitely want to turn his fortunes around here. There's the changeup. Get down the line. Third baseman eats that one up. Throws it across the diamond, and they're out of the inning. Garrett Velez is up the bat for Tennessee here. He's one for one on the day. Slider outside, and he's going to get another base knock. All right, so they got some speed on the base pass here. Come on, Hallie. There it is. Good pitch. That's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. <clears throat> All right, where do we go to next? I'm going to go fastball up. Let's try to get it on his hands. Left that one a little bit over the plate. More, you know, a little bit lower than I wanted to. That one was really supposed to be out of the zone. Try to throw him out, Ozzy. All right, one day here, finally. Let's get a ground ball. Oh, I didn't realize he was still in. That's one of the downfalls of playing without the sound on, and I wasn't I wasn't even looking. So, Tennessee got aggressive on us there. They put a man in scoring position. All right. The, the, the computer very rarely steals in this game. So, you know, that, that really threw me off. That was that was beautiful on their part. They had the, they had the scout report. They know we don't really keep the, we don't really hold the runners. We don't really keep check on them. Oh, that's gone. That's gone. Oh, it's not. Zelly Cummins with the amazing play. Can we double him up? We are unable to. And Zelly Cummins showing off the leather out there in left field, running into the wall. Now we got our work cut out for us. This is the guy, Bushini, that hit the home run in the uh, second inning. And he's going to get another base knock. You they got Wills. Ozzy Zaniga unable to cleanly come up with the rock. And we are going to give up the second run. Bushini with his second RBI here on the day. Ozzy Zaniga really letting us down there and not making a play in right field. All right, so Halley, Halley's down 2-1 here. There's a ground ball. Fatma making a play up the box, and he throws him out at first. And not before we're, we give up another run. We finally end the inning here. Top five coming up, 8-9-1. All right, Clevenger, let's go. Only 185 here this season. 0 for 1 of the day. But you've had some big timely hits here, so we need you. Ah, that one was that one was crushed just right at the third baseman. All right, Fatma, come on, baby. We need some base runners. <sighs> Way out in front of that. All right, come on, leadoff. Come on, Isaac. 0 for 2 in the day. We need that speed on. Ah, the third baseman literally got all the action this inning. Gobbled everything up, threw everybody out, and that was going to be, they make quick work of us. 8-9-1 up the bat here for Tennessee. Howley's still, Howley's still throwing strong, man. The one home run he gave up wasn't necessarily crushed. The second RBI he gave up, you know what I mean, a little Texas leaguer in the right field, mishandled by his fielder, we, you know, didn't really give us a chance to throw him out. So, you know, I'm, I'm liking the way he's pitching. He's still pitching fairly strong. You know, his bat, you know, his, his offense has just got to wake up and get something done for him here. Slurve away. Ozzy Zaniga under it, and we got out number one. All right, here's their, here's their catcher, Scott, Pistan, Scott, Scott, Scott Pistan, you know, nine-hole hitter. Slider away. He gets that down for a base knock. All right, here's Ola Rude, their leadoff guy, I believe. He's two for two on a day. Rick Wright played that retardedly, but you know he eventually, you know, makes it stop the steps on first. We got two down here. All right, let's go, Hallie. One more pitch, baby. Good spot. Let's go. Slurve inside. Oh, that one's hit hard back up the box. Show it off, Isaac. Show it off, Isaac. Okay. I, I thought they would think better of that. All right, runners on the corner. Garrett Galvis. Two for two on the day here, but two dead. We just need you to make a pitch, Hallie. 
Fama's there to make the play. He tosses it to Roy, and we're out of the inning. Thank you. <clears throat> All right, two, three, four coming up to bat, man. Let's 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 wake these sticks up, boys. All right, Ozzy Zanigas, one for two in the day. We could use a base knock right here. Ah, he hit that one hard, but it's going to hang up there and stay in the ballpark. <clears throat> All right, come on, Rick. We need some of your magic here today, kid. Let's get a hold of one. Ah, got to hit that where it's pitched. We pulled off of a changeup way out in front of it. Damn. Kyle Foster's 0 for 2 today. He hasn't even hit it. He hit the first one hard. There it is. Wow, he smoked that ball. Smoke that ball just right at the second baseman. <clears throat> All right, come on, Ali. It's probably going to be your last inning here. Ground ball to Clevenger. Easy work. All right. Bottom six here. Slider inside. That slider is 92. That's filthy. It's not much you can do with a 92 mile per hour slider. Top with the two seamer. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Way behind him. Way in behind. Two seamer again. Ah. Throw him out, Ozzy. All right, so we're going to go ahead and uh, warm up warm up a pitcher. You guys already know where we're going to. Colin Colin Daniel. That's, that's the go-to guy out of the pen. Give us that ground ball there as we get the tough, you know, we get the strike there with the 94 mile power two seam inside. That's the that's the, that pitch is money. That pitch in this in the slider, those pitches do damage. That one was left a little bit over the middle of the plate, though. All right. Runners on first and second, one out. Let's go ahead and take a look at our bullpen. Colin Daniel was not yet ready. We'll try to get Hallie to pitch us out of this. Ooh, that would have pissed me off if that stayed fair. Wow, that would have been that would have, that would have hurt my heart. Now they're gonna to try to bunt him over, and that's foul ball number two. All right, so we're gonna force him to hit here. Get him, yes sir! Big time strikeout by Dawson Howley, baby. Let's go! Just reached back and threw it as hard as he could, man. We need you to we need you to get us out of this one more time, kid. One more time. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Gotta be careful. These runners are running on contact with two strikes. So anything hit, you know what I'm saying? They're probably gonna score off of it. We get him, catch him with the slur. We throw him off, catch him looking. Two seamer away. Get him out of here. Ah! That ball gets down. They're not gonna run on Zelly's arm. All right, Scott Pastan up here. We're gonna go ahead and do a little mound visit. Colin Daniel was just about ready. For some reason, Dawson Howley is responding negatively. The coach is, is, is ripping him a new one for some reason. We're going to go ahead and sub in Colin Daniel. Go to the pen. Get him in here. All right, Colin. One out. We need one out from you, kid. There it is. Ground ball. Roy eats it up, tosses it over to first, and we get out of this inning. Boy, was that close. We, we're, we're right in striking distance, man. You know what I mean? We got to get out of here. Five, six, seven coming up the bat for us here. We've given up 11 hits so far. We only have four. All right, Pimentel. Two for two on the day. Don't see that every day here from Pimentel, but, you know, he's got some of his stamina back. He's ready. No, get foul. <clears throat> All right, here we go. Oh, one. Oh, get down. That's trouble. That's trouble. That's a double. That's a double. When you're hot, you're hot. Three for three on the day is Pimentel, and he gets in there with a with a leadoff double, baby. Let's go. All right, Zelly, your turn to do what you got to do. Get it down. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Sacrifice. He actually might beat that out. Ooh, that was a tough throw. What a, what a pick there by the second baseman. But Zelly Cummins gets down to sacrifice. John Roy, you 0 for 2 on the day, but we just need a ground ball to the right side to get us a run. That's all we need. Ah, that slinker. Wasn't ready for it. Wasn't ready for it. And it was in a spot you couldn't really touch it. You know, you don't hit the ball well there. So, let's go. I need you. There it is. Oh, I don't know why they sent them back to tag. Get there. Get there, Pimentel. Woo! He didn't slide, but he scores. Oh, my gosh, dog. If he would not have scored, I would have cussed his game out. <laughs> but John Roy comes up huge with an RBI single, baby. Let's go. Tie ball game here in the top of the seventh. Come on, Clepinger. Woo! 
Oh no, get back, get back, get back. I thought it was going to drop. <laughs> almost, almost got us doubled up there. All right, nine hole hitter Jacob Fatma. He led us in extra base hits at one point in this season in triples. That change up. Oh, that was the one. Ah, we let him get in on our hands. Tried to hit and run. Hey, man, but we tied it up. Let's go. Big time AB from John Roy. Pimentel is three for three. Zelly Cummins came through with the sack bunt. Let's go, baby. We just need Colin Daniels to do what he does out of the bullpen. <coughs> <laughs> All right, bottom seven here. Ah, that one gets through the six hole. This Tennessee team can hit, man. I didn't, you know, I didn't think they couldn't hit or nothing like that, but they hit way better as they got a lefty up in the bullpen. We got to try to double these dudes up here. They're actually gonna try to bunt them over. We throw it up, and that one is gonna get foul. He's gonna try to bunt again. We're gonna go up top. Okay, they're hitting. They're swinging this time. Please stay in the ballpark. Ozzy's there to make the play. Of course, we're going to try to throw him out at first, and they get back. All right, we got Galvis up. He's two for three on the day. Just give me a little ground ball here, Colin. Zelly Cummins is under that. Can of corn. Two dead. All right, here we go. This is one of the better hitters, but we got him 0 for today. He hits a lazy line out to John Roy, and we get out of this inning after giving off a leadoff hit, baby. Let's go. Come on, Isaac. I need you here, kid. Be a leadoff. You 0 for 3 on the day. I need you to I need you to make him sweat a little bit. There it is. Get down. There we go. We got 98 speed on the base paths. Gotta be careful though. They love pitching out while Isaac is uh while Isaac is on the base. And they actually go to the bullpen. Bonds day is done for. Is done for. Done for today. However, I'm supposed to say that. Ooh, he went. <clears throat> His windup is herky jerky. It's like he's about to throw super hard immediately. We're gonna try a little hit and run here. Oh, they go with the off-speed pitch with Isaac Stupid. Johnson running. Oh, go to third. Go. That's what – oh, we're scoring. That's what Wills would do to a defense. You put the pressure on them and they make mistakes. Let's go, Isaac. That's why we love getting you on base. That's why it's so important when you get on base, dog. Let's go, man. We take the lead. And they come to Ozzy. He's laid on it. Ground ball to second base. But, hey, man, we, we got the job done. All right, come on, Rick. You haven't gotten a hit in a minute. You're facing lefty. This is your due. I didn't. I check swung. Damn, man, that ah! I did not. You see, I didn't want to swing at that. I was just trying to let go. Damn, man, that was not where I wanted it. Kyle Foster over three on the day. Not that great against lefties, though. Tries to sneak that one down the line. These, these, they're, these, their corner infielders are beasts out here. But hey, we do what we got to do to get on the base paths here. Bottom eight here. Colin Daniel up. Connor Daniel here still on the mound. Let him do his thing. And then we're going to go to our closer, D'Angelo Brandon. You know what I mean? If we don't get any extra runs on the board, and we're going to close this thing out. Beautiful pitch. Make that play, Fatma. Dang. He tried to make his signature dive and play. Unable to make it. Cummins gets it in. He thought he 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 rounded first hella aggressively. You see here, Ron Trez Bushimi. Three for three on the day. Two ribbies, a home run. Oh, he's, they're going to bunt him? Wow. Definitely didn't see that coming. Throw the ball. Pimentel outside. Whew. Didn't think he was going to get it out. They sack. They, you know, that's unselfish. You're three for three on the day with a home run, two RBIs, and you still lay down a bunt. They don't complain about it. That's the ball hit down the line. Rick Wright is there to eat it up. We got two dead with a runner on third. I think it looks like they're going with a pitch hitter here. Come on, Colin. Do what you do, baby. Good pitch. Good pitch, good spot, perfect spot, right into the cold zone. That's not where he don't want to see the ball there. All right, here we go. Curveball here. There it is. Make the play, Fatma. Fire it over the first, and we're out of the inning, baby. We are just three outs away from getting the W here, man. First we got first we first we we got some hitters coming up. Pimentel's who three for who's three for three. Zully Cummins with a big sack bunt. They go to the bullpen once again. They bring Groves up. Jacob Pimentel, you see, three for three with a double and a run score, baby. Let's go. This time he's back from the right side. Ooh, they try to come inside and they give us some, they give us some fits. Okay. This dude isn't playing. He came, oh, came straight in, throwing gas. Then he tries to go to all speed stuff. We hit it, try to hit it back up the box. Probably should have turned on it, and that's going to be the first out of the day. 
What I need, what we need to do here, we almost forgot. We need to go to the bullpen. Oh, Wilson is our closer, but I'm, I'm trusting in D'Angelo Brandon. That's, you know what I mean? He's going to be our closer. Come on, Zelly. Let's see if you can get something going here. Up the box. That a boy. Zelly Cummins with his first knock of the day. He was way overdue, man. He's been struggling mightily here. Let's see if John Roy can get us a big time knock here. Let's keep it going. Oh, he pitched out, and I freaking swung. <laughs> it's too hyper. I, I don't want to get beat by that fastball again. He comes with the all-speed stuff. Roy turns on it. Left fielder is going to be able to get there and make the play. All right, so one we're down to our final out of the, of the ninth inning here. Club is 0 for 3 on the day. He, But like I said, he has power against lefties. Ooh, that was your one, baby. Right in your hot zone, dog. We just a tad bit too late. Come on here, kid. I dare him to try us again. He did, and we smash it down the line. Third baseman lays out, makes a stop, but it's still going to be a single. Clepinger gets his first knock of the day. All right. Fatma's up to bat. He's over three. You guys already know. We're going to go ahead. We're going to go ahead and sub him out if they let me. All right. We're going to go ahead. Pinch hit for Fatma. We're going to bring in Johnson, who had a big-time double last game. You know what I'm saying? So go ahead and bring John, Jonathan Johnson in. 65 to 63 power, contact and power against lefties. Come on, kid. There it is. Get down, ball. Ah, just didn't quite drive it. All right, man. So we are three outs away from winning this ball game. We were unable to add to the lead or anything like that. They have 9-1-2 coming up the bat. All right, baby. Let's go. So they're going to actually sub out per stand here. And, you know, for now, I'm going to leave Daniel on the mound. Because this is what he does out of the bullpen as he leaves that pitch way higher than he should have. And John Roy makes an amazing diving catch. What a web gym, baby. It does not get any better than that. Let's go, man. I'm fired up right now. Derek Olerud up the bat. He's 3 for 4 on the day. 373 on the year. Come on, Colin. Keep doing your thing. That a baby. Let's go. I'm hyped, man. I mean, if you guys can't tell by now, I'm lit, dog. Let's go. This is what we do, man. John Roy, man. One of the best defending shortstops in the country. Fastball low and away. He didn't like it. He didn't like it. Whew. All right. One more pitch. Lazy ground ball to Rick Wright. Gobbles it up. Steps on first. Two dead. Two dead, everybody. Let's go. Let's try to... Try to jam him up a little bit. That's a ball oh, on John Roy, of course, ends the game. What another diving stop. And we get a big-time victory here, baby. Game number one. Let's go, dog. That's what I'm talking about. Woo! We gave up 13 hits. We had an error, but we had nine hits, and they had an error. You know, their error is actually what cost them the game. Isaac Johnson using that speed, baby. The shuffle guy coming through. Take a look at the box score. Isaac Johnson, 1 for 4. Ozzy Zaniga, 1 for 4. Rick Wright, 1 for 4. Kyle Foster actually went 0 for today. Pimentel, 3 for 4. Uh, 1 for 3 for both Cummings and Roy. Kleppinger, 1 for 4. Fatma and Johnson went 0 for as well. You know, going over them, they had some dudes who had some big games. Leadoff man was 3 for 5. Galvez was 2 for 4. 2 for 4. Uh, Mannon was 2 for 4. Bashimi was 3 for 3. What, you know, oh, they, oh, so they didn't give him an RBI on that because Ozzy, Ozzy Zaniga made that error. So kudos to them, man. That's actually properly scored. Check, Colin Daniel moves on to 8-0 on the season. And the Bond, their, start, their pitcher, drops to 7-6. All right, boys, so that's going to do it here for today's episode in game number one in his best of three series here in the Super Regional, you know, against Tennessee. They're the one seed. We were a three seed. We got the job done. Hopefully, you guys are excited for the next episode, man. And, you know, because I damn sure am. We, our boys fought hard and they came through and got the W. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. If you did, stop and smash that like button. Hit me up in the comment section below. Subscribe if you're new. It's your boy, Uncle Sam's Reject, RKGames.com. I'm out of here. Peace.